started in uh, high school uh, in, um, let's see, would have been the uh, late 70s. My personal achievement, mm -hmm. I think, is still rowing at my age, being over 50. Jim Quirk has been rowing for over three decades. He says his rowing gets a little better every day. He also thinks the serenity of rowing makes you aware of your surroundings. I think the, the biggest thing is the uh, slow application of effort. Um, every day you can make just a little bit of progress and ultimately it starts to uh, build up to a lot. Little nuances that are wholly unnoticed as you're riding along on a car or on the side of the road or even bicycling or running along the river are very important to someone that's actually on it. Like Jim, not all rowers are focused on competing. Some just want peace on the water. It is so beautiful. It's wonderful to be out here as the sun's rising and see all the boats. So it's really nice to see that and be out there with you know the geese and the ducks and stuff. It's really it's very peaceful. It's a good way to start the day. It feels great. It feels very peaceful. Strangely, this is probably the most peaceful and wonderful part of at least my day. Rowing is a very popular sport in our city. This October, the 48th Head of the Charles Regatta will take place. 8,000 athletes from all over the world will compete, and over 300,000 spectators will be watching. Reporting for Jason's, I'm Enid Kalo.